international break, including key players. Can you give us any update on those players? Uh, yeah, um, yeah, for sure uh, it's important to, to check uh, uh, two, three situations. Yeah, and uh, and then to, to make the best uh, the best decision uh, tomorrow. Uh, yeah, this week uh, wasn't easy uh, to work uh, after the national break. So someone has come back with uh, some problems, and uh, it's important now to to check, to wait, uh, and then uh, tomorrow to to make the best decision. But. I have two, two, three uh, situations to uh, to evaluate. Yeah, to evaluate. Among the names Costa, Cortva, Hazard, Moses, Terry, or any of those players ruled out as things stand? Mm, yeah, I, I think that. Uh, <laughs> uh, these players, uh, these players. Uh, yeah, it's important to check to check uh, uh, their situation. And uh, John uh, is good, and John uh, is trained all the week. And uh, yeah, for uh, for the other, uh, it's, uh, it's important to, to check the situation. I mentioned Hazard. There are reports from Spain that say Chelsea would listen to offers for Eden Hazard. For the record, is that true? <laughs> is that true? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I don't know, but. I'm, re I'm repeating uh, always the, the, the same thing, that uh, now uh, it's very important to be focused for my players uh, on the present. Uh, don't look uh, uh, too far forward, because it's very dangerous. Uh, the only thing that I can say is uh, Eden is uh, a Chelsea player, he's uh, an our player and uh, we are happy with him. He's happy with us, and uh, I, I don't see uh, problems about him. Do you see this as an attempt to unsettle Hazard? Uh, if Hazard? Is it a, an attempt to unsettle the player? Uh, Destabilise, unsettle. Tomorrow? So, no, to cause problems with Hazard. Do you see this as an attempt from the rumours? Yeah, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I think that uh, uh, this is a part of the uh, of a play, and uh, uh, also for, for the other to put these uh, these rumors to try to uh, to create a bit of difficulty in the mind of the players. And uh, yeah, but uh, I think uh, that we have a, a great experience to face this uh, situation, and also my players have this uh, uh, this experience. It's uh, it's normal, it's logical in this part of the season to start rumors about uh, about uh, our player, and uh, I'm very happy because uh, uh, it means that we are doing uh, uh, a great job with my players. Because uh, uh, if uh, Chelsea player are requested about uh, the other teams, it means that uh, they are doing very well. For you as the manager, how important is he for the the long term? vision of your time at the club and, and would you like to see the club offer him maybe a new contract? But I, 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 but I repeat, I, I don't see, I don't see any problem uh, about uh, about our players, and uh, we all know that uh, we are in a great club with a great ambition, and uh, uh, there is a great will to to do great things in uh, in the future. But I hope to do great things in uh, in the present because uh, don't forget um, that uh, there are uh, uh, 10 games uh, uh, to play and uh, we hope to finish this season with a great uh, success for for us for 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 the club for our fans but i repeat and uh, we stay in a great club with great ambition and uh, they will uh, uh, of uh, all is to build a, a great team. You are 10 points clear. How do you assess the title race at the moment? <sighs> if, uh, How do you view the title race with 10 points yeah. clear? 
in, uh, in my past, uh, I uh, I lived uh, two different experiences, one positive and another negative. And uh, for this reason, uh, I I like to repeat that uh, we need uh, 21 points uh, to be uh, to be champions. And uh, for sure, tomorrow uh, we have to play um, uh, a game very tough for us because after international break is not easy. In this week, uh, um, we faced uh, uh, with uh, a lot of problems. Tomorrow, I think uh, I think that tomorrow is a game very difficult for 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 us. For, for many reasons, and for this reason, uh, we have to pay great attention tomorrow. It's a game of uh, fun fundamental importance for, uh, for for us tomorrow. Okay, um, John. Um, ben Hazard, have you have you spoken to him? Have you sat down and had a chat with him about about next season and where he he mentally is at the moment? No, no, I don't think uh, it's important to to talk about him. Uh, I like uh, to talk with with him about this season, uh, about the uh, the importance of this game. Um, uh, he missed the last game against uh, Stock City, and uh, uh, his form. Uh, we have to check his uh, his form, but I hope to uh, to stay very well and to show tomorrow. Uh, Oh, great, uh, great things! Yes, to to play a uh, great football. Uh, I like to to talk about this, not uh, other uh, other uh, other speech. Yes. I'm confident he'll be fit tomorrow to play. Yeah, I'm confident. I'm confident, but uh, I'm confident to mm, not only to play, but uh, to play really good. Yes, it's <laughs> different. Eh? Yeah. Um, the other the other player worked some stories um, recently is John Terry. Possibly he's going to be offered a, a one, another one-year contract. Do you know anything about that? For, for every situation, for, for every situation, uh, there will be the, the right moment to, to face. I think that the club uh, is uh, is vo working very well uh, to solve uh, uh, many situations that we have uh, we have to face. But I repeat, uh, John. Uh, I like I like to to talk about John for for this season because uh, he's helping me a lot. And uh, yeah, uh, I repeat, he's uh, he's uh, he's doing a, a great job, a great job uh, so on and out the pitch. Quite well, like him to to stay for one. I say he's been really helpful this season. Yeah, but yeah, I think uh, John uh, John knows my. My my thought about him, and I think uh, 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 the most important thing is this: uh, that John to to know my my thought. Then so twenty one more points, and you win the title. Ten yeah. games to go. Yeah. Given you've only lost three all season, I mean you must be pretty confident, aren't you now that it's you're all you're almost there. Uh. I, I lost uh, a part of the the, so you, the, you the question. Lost, you only lost three games all yeah, season. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to win seven of your last. Okay, games. yeah, yeah. Guaranteed. So you, you're almost there. Yeah, understand. Uh, yeah, but the football is strange. The football uh, is uh, full of surprise, and uh, I repeat, in my in my experience uh, as as footballer, uh, I won a lot. But I think I lost more, and uh, uh, and for this reason uh, I want to uh, to keep our uh, our feet uh, on the ground. It's very important. It's for me, for my players, also because uh, after uh, this type of of the season, uh, great work, hard work, uh, and uh, a lot of difficult uh, the uh, a lot of difficulties to. To overcome the problems, I think that uh, we deserve to, to win. But there are uh, ten games to go, and uh, for sure uh, the, our opponent uh, uh, don't want to, uh, yeah, to to resign, uh, don't want to to accept 
uh, that Chelsea is uh, is champions. And for this reason, uh, we have to pay great, great attention in these uh, ten games and to tr to try to to get three points uh, uh, from tomorrow at home. But uh, it will be very uh, very difficult. Okay, Antonio. Uh, we know that you don't like to talk about transfers. You like yeah. Chelsea to do things privately. Does it frustrate you that other clubs seem to do things more publicly when they're pursuing players, as Madrid seem to be doing with Eden? No, honestly, no. Not because uh, I think uh, is uh, is positive. Uh, this is positive because. Uh, when uh, other uh, top team uh, wants your player, uh, it means that we are doing a, a really good job together uh, with the players and uh, it's great. I think uh, we must be proud about this because uh, it means that we have in our team uh, good players, um, that uh, they are doing a, a good job. But I, I repeat, uh, um, I think that now uh, we uh, we stay already in a great club with uh, with great ambition and uh, we want we want to build something important uh, for the present and the future and uh, I think that uh, we have uh, just started our path. Matt and Antonio Arsene Wenger yesterday said there's only one team in London. What would you agree with? Uh, no, I, no, I, I, uh, I didn't know. I didn't know this. But I think uh, that uh, <laughs> in London uh, uh, there are uh, uh, many teams, and uh, tomorrow, for example, for us uh, is uh, is a derby against uh, Crystal Palace, and uh, in London uh, the, there are uh, uh, many many teams. Then. Uh, uh, I repeat, and uh, uh, I like uh, I like to uh, to listen uh, the other coaches, but uh, uh, for me, I prefer always to have a great respect for uh, for uh, all the players, uh, for all uh, all the clubs. Um, Sam Allardyce said that he would have had more respect for his management career if he was Aladici, Italian or Portuguese. Do you, do you agree with that? But uh, I knew him. I knew him uh, in my uh, in my travel in England, and uh, I uh, I stayed with uh, with him uh, for two days uh, in uh, West Ham in training in West Ham's training ground. Yeah, I had the opportunity to uh, to speak with him. I think uh, he's a uh, he's a top coach, and uh, for sure it's a pity. Um, for him, uh, uh, has been sacked uh, for the national team after uh, only one game, because uh, I I know I know the the importance to uh, uh, to be the coach uh, in uh, in uh, your country for the national team is a is a great it's a great it's great, but for sure and uh, for me it's a, it's a great pleasure tomorrow uh, to see him and uh, to. To chat with him before before the game and then after the game. Okay, last couple at the back. Antonio, because of Brexit, we could lose some European player in the future, like because players they are not playing in the national team, uh, like Santiago with Equator. What what's your view on that? Do you think the your, your Premier League should have it exempt from the rules of uh, education for Brexit? Yeah, I think I think now now it's uh, it's too early to uh, to talk about this uh, this topic. But I'm sure uh, in the future that uh, uh, they they will find the the right solution, the right solution. And uh, yeah, I'm I'm sure about this. Okay, last one in this section in the middle there. Antonio, earlier you said you think tomorrow is going to be a very difficult game. Yeah. Is that because you think Crystal Palace are a better team now than when you played them in December? But I, I, I remember very well uh, the, the game against Crystal Palace and I think uh, also in, uh, in, uh, in that game uh, uh, yeah, we, we deserved to win but uh, uh, we suffered uh, also. 
uh, because Crystal Palace uh, uh, has a, a lot of, uh, of uh, really good player, great players, because uh, Benteke is a top player and the same uh, uh, Zaha and uh, Townsend uh, is another player that uh, I like uh, a lot and uh, Kabaye and uh, Punchon and uh, Zaha, a lot, a lot of great players. And if you ask me uh, why they stay in, uh, in this position, uh, I don't know. I don't know because it's very strange when you have uh, um, this, uh, uh, this team with this uh, uh, great player to stay in that position. But it uh, can happen, uh, can happen. Uh, uh, last season happened uh, uh, to Chelsea, <laughs> yeah, for example. Uh, but uh, we have to pay great attention because, uh, uh, I repeat, uh, uh, in the last three games they won. In, uh, in the last six games uh, in the table, they are sixth. And for this reason, uh, we have to pay great, uh, great attention. Uh, above all, after uh, the international break. Above all, because uh, uh, we faced uh, a lot of, uh, of problems in this, uh, in this week. Okay, cameras off there, please. Thank you. Thank you.